Welcome to another sneak peek of SOLIDWORKS 2015 where today we're going to take a look at some new enhancements for simulation, specifically when calculating your results in nonlinear. In this example, we want to take a look at how this clip will interact when it engages with this rod. To do this, we've started a nonlinear 2D simplified simulation. There's a few things we need to do to set this up yet. For example, we need to add some fixtures. In this case, a fixed geometry relationship to the outside of the rod and a fixed hinge down here to the hinge component itself. Now all that's left is to go ahead and run our results. You'll notice now in SOLIDWORKS 2015 we get incremental results while we're solving. So I can very easily find problems both in my simulation and in the design of my products while they're calculating. This is great as nonlinear simulations can sometimes take a long time to solve and saving me any time is always going to be valuable. Here we can see that it looks like there's a problem where the clip itself isn't penetrating the rod. So we can actually choose to cancel solving these results right now. We can then go back and immediately start making the required changes. In this case, we want to make some changes to the simulation by adding some contact sets. In this case, we want to specify that there's no penetration allowed between these components here and here. Once that's done, all we need to do is go ahead and start running our study again. Again, SOLIDWORKS will immediately start generating the results in real time, allowing us to see if there's any problems. In this case, we'll go ahead and speed this up, just because it takes a lot longer to calculate the clip going around the rod. But as you can see from this example, in SOLIDWORKS 2015, it's a lot easier to quickly identify potential problems, as mentioned before, both in the design of your parts, but also in the simulation results themselves. This ultimately can save you a lot of time in getting your results that you desire faster in SOLIDWORKS 2015.